what's going on guys, it's me Ryan, and we're back in Pokemon Darkrai. Uh, I did some research in between episodes, and I have some stuff planned out to do in this episode. Um, also, in between episodes, I did a couple, quite a bit of grinding, got some of my guys' levels up, uh, but did not complete any bit of the story, so it's all good. So, the first thing you're going to do, is you're going to want to go into this guy's house, and basically, um... He lets you, like, sleep, but then you have this dream, and you wake up in the torn world, and we're here, and, um, yeah, uh, I'm going to, I do not know what to do from here on, uh, why don't we look, mm. okay, can't go on that, oops, Shadow and light will fuse, and strange world will be open. I summon the bringer of shadow and the almighty disorder Pokemon. That would be Giratina. Let's go into the f um, portal. This is the torn world. That looks pretty cool. Uh, th yeah, this is awesome. Hmm. Oh, I can walk across it. Wait, no, I can't. Why can't I walk across this? Um... How do I do this? Oops, <laughs> my bad. Oh, that worked. Okay. Um, can I do it? No. Oh, that worked. Okay, and this is the. Here, uh, oh, that worked. Okay. Uh, okay. Hmm. How? Hey, what? If I can get off this thing, I swear to gosh. Oh, there it goes. What even is that? Uh, what the heck? Alrighty, come on. Oh no. Okay, okay. I feel like I've been here before, but okay. Why can't I cross this? It's an actual piece of land. Can't even cross it. Why? There it goes. Okay. That did absolutely nothing in my face. Wait. Wait a minute. No. What the heck? You've lost your consciousness. You sort of woke up a few seconds later. Okay, so we woke up. Here's the old man. Um, how might I get up now? Um... Yeah, how do I get up? Oh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Sorry, but that was like testing to see if I had my thing on the cursor. Hmm. Platforms appear and disappear at the end of a loud cry that could be heard. It's supposed to be Giratina, Mighty Sword of Pokemon. You're the. Ch okay, that was. Oh, that was me. So basically, this guy's just kind of like laughing at me. And, oh, who is that but Team Rocket? Oh, jeez. Okay. Ooh, battle, shall we? Curtis! This is one of the guys I caught, is Rattata. Named him Curtis. I know haters will hate. Um, I got a Surskit, and I leveled up Rocky, and um, I caught a Pidgeotto. And that was about it. I didn't really do anything. Other than level these guys up. I didn't really level Kui Lava up. It's kind of already high level for this, at least. Yeah. <laughs> you might notice. Okay. Curtis, level 6. 
I know that uh, Rattata does not. Well, oh, wait, my bad. Rattata does not do, does not evolve to eradicate until like level 42. So um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep Curtis that long, but I do like eradicate. Um, so yeah. What you beat me? Yeah, damn straight, I've beaten you. I don't have. I don't care what you have to say, Team Rocket. Why wouldn't you just use a Voltorb on me? <laughs> you would have beaten me. Oh, wait, no, you wouldn't beat me. You would have done better. I'm too stacked right now. Rusty Pokeball did belong to the Team Rocket member. Recently fled. You're able to obtain the Pokeball. Taking things that doesn't belong to means you can hurt your karma. It might affect the storyline. Yes. <laughs> I do not care. <laughs> Oh, it's the Grimer! Grimer, sludgy and rubbery body can be forced through any opening. Yeah, I, that sounded really weird. I wish I hadn't said that aloud. Okay, so, next part of the thing I would like to get done. Um, so, we have this uh, forest here, and uh, if you notice that there is a... Um, here, I'll just go ahead and fly through real fast. Uh, try not to run into too many people. No! Um, wait a minute, let me just go through here, no, 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 how do I even go through that, this, anyway, so there's an end to it, okay, and I'm not even going to go through it, because it's going to be too much of a waste of time, but there's an end of the forest, and there's no stairs, and you have to get out, but the way you get out is, um, based on time, and it's actually kind of cool, so, um, the thing you're going to have to do, if you're on Visual Boy Advance like I am, uh, you're going to have to uh, kind of, I know I just made that really small, um, hang on a minute, let me just, can I cut this down, okay, yeah, I just needed to, okay, so you open up this window right here, and uh, you go to options, and then you go to yeah, emulator, and then you go down and you click real-time clock. Okay, now that you have it on real-time clock, let me just put this up real fast. Okay. Now that you have it on real-time clock, what you're going to want to do is just go to your computer settings. And, uh, wait, it already is between 5 and 6. Okay, so never mind. So what you have to do, once it's on, since it's on real-time clock, is that you have to, um... If it's in between 5 and 6, uh, on real-time clock then um, you, the stairs should be open, uh, hopefully they will be, but if it's not, then it's not going to work. Come on, freaking Curtis. I thought Curtis suits the Rotata very well. Get to this part, zoom through here, no, damn it. I need, to I need to start using repels when I'm recording. So anyway, yeah, you'll notice the stairs are not here, but it should work. I don't understand why it doesn't work. Wait a minute. Sorry, I did that again. <laughs> hmm. What do we want? Options, emulator, real-time clock. Why isn't this working? No. Let's try changing it in here. option um the stairs should have opened I do not know why the time it looks like the time didn't even change um so I am just gonna go have to I'm gonna have to uh end the video here guys uh I will the next video it should be a success getting the stairs to work. But, um, yeah, guys, I'll see you next time on Idiots Try Gaming.